Consider the neutralization of magnesium hydroxide by hydrochloric acid. What volume of 0 0.200 molar hydrochloric acid solution is required to neutralize 0 0.200 moles of magnesium hydroxide? Is it A, 500 milliliters, B, 1 liter, C, 2 liters, or D? four liters. The amount of reactants and products involved in a reaction are directly proportional. The multiple -mole ratio is implied by the coefficients in the balanced equation. Mathematically, we can say that if substances 1 and 2 are involved in a reaction, then the ratio of the moles of substances 1 and 2 involved in the reaction are N1 over N2 is equal to the ratio of their coefficients C1 over C2. We can rearrange this equation to solve for N1 if we know N2. To calculate N1, we simply multiply N2 by the ratio of coefficients. Let's see how we can apply this equation to the question we are working on. We assign our known moles to N2. Since we're given that 0 0.200 moles of magnesium hydroxide are to be neutralized, we assign this to N2. We then multiply it by a conversion factor so that we can determine the amount of HCl that would also be consumed. Since we're interested in HCl, we put the coefficient of HCl in the numerator which is 2 and put the coefficient of magnesium hydroxide in the denominator. The coefficient of magnesium hydroxide in the balanced equation is not shown. This means that it is implied to be 1. The ratio of coefficients serves as a conversion factor. Carrying out the indicated calculations, we find that 0 0.400 moles of HCl would be needed to neutralize 0 0.200 moles of magnesium hydroxide. Note that we keep three significant digits in our answer since the least precise term in our calculation, 0 0.200, has only three significant digits. The numbers 2 and 1 in the conversion factor are exact, but we're being asked for the volume of 0 0.200 molar hydrochloric acid. In other words, the question essentially becomes this. What volume of 0 0.200 molar hydrochloric acid contains 0 0.400 moles of HCl? we need to use the defining equation for molarity. Molarity is defined as the moles of solute per liter of solution. Mathematically then, we calculate molarity by dividing the amount of solute in moles by the volume of the solution in liters. For this problem, we know the number of moles of solute, 0 0.400 moles and we know the molarity, 0 0.200 moles per liter. We're being asked for the volume, so we rearrange the defining equation to solve for V. The volume in liters is equal to the number of moles of solute divided by the molarity, which gives us an answer of two liters. The correct answer is C.